Saseni Karibu to Rosie's Rendezvous. Where it's all about good cooking and cooking for the masses. Hiya basi. Leo tunapika chicken soup for the soul. A.K.A. The food. The chili season dictates that we have a lot of warm drinks, a lot of soups for our souls and a lot of immunity boosting stuff, you know. To get started, you will need chicken bones from any part that you don't use. These are the chicken scraps that you normally don't cook when you're cooking chicken. This can be the spine, the tips of drumsticks that are full of cartilage, or even the wings. Yes, I know wings. Very contradictory, but I learned not many people like the winged part of a chicken. So use it in making soups. Save on the leftovers. To season the soup, I used one onion, carrot, two cloves of garlic, two knobs of ginger, and one bay leaf. I put the pieces evenly across the pan and browned them on high heat. Once the browning started, I put in my vegetables, mixed it up and covered. After 5 minutes, I poured in 5 cups of water. Cover and let the soup boil for about 40 to 45 minutes. On this day, I also had an audience waiting for the dhufu. So if you see movement, please just just forgive them. Walikuwa nagojia tu soup. Tavadhari, tavadhari. Yeah, yeah. While the soup is simmering, you need to remove the indecencies floating at the top. Please do not skip this part if you want clear, good-looking soup. After two hours of simmering and occasional stirring and occasional sieving of the indecencies, I sieved my soup into a jug and stored it in a glass container, left it to cool on the side and then chilled it until I needed to use it. I also poured a cup for myself, added some salt and chili and tada! Immunity boosting, here we go, tunakuja, hakuna corona, hakuna flu for us, come on now, come on. And there we have it, chicken broth aka chicken soup aka vufu for your soul. If you like this video, please be sure to like, share and subscribe for more food content coming your way. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!